Hey, what's up, creators? Welcome back to Make Money Editing. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a fully personalized, ultra-realistic avatar that can talk, make gestures, stand, work, and do anything you prompt it to do. AI is currently the big thing right now. This video you just watched was 100% created with AI. First, I was able to generate the image and of course i was able to turn it into a moving avatar like this i'm going to show you how i was able to create this from the perfect lip sync into the perfect movement and all of the things you can see right away and i will also show you how you can also manipulate it to create anything you want it to do from the jumping you can either make your ai to swim to run to do anything that you literally want it to do this is simple prompting i'm going to show you how you can do it and i'm going to show you the trick that you can use to make ai do whatever you want it to do and interestingly this was created using the free versions of all these websites i'm going to be showing you in this video so if you really want to try this out watch this video to the end so first we we'll start with the image prompting so here we're going to copy this text right here to help chat gpt to create an avatar for us so depending on what you want chat gpt is going to come up with an interesting ai avatar for you you can go ahead to make changes to it if you want so you can go around to play with it and see what you can actually create. So once ChatGPT has been able to come up with a prompt, the next thing you're going to do is coming over to Leonardo AI where you're going to generate the images. So here on the web version of Leonardo AI, you're going to come here to get started. If you've not registered, go ahead to sign in. And of course, once you come in here, you can paste the prompt from ChatGPT. You can come here to your settings option right and you make sure you set the model to the flux dev option flux dev and of course you're going to come here to set the aspect ratio to 16 by 9. once this is done you can go ahead to generate your images and in a couple of seconds to minutes you can see your images really looking stunning so here are some of the images i was able to create using leonardo ai and you can see how really realistic and how stunning they are so now here is one of the interesting parts of this tutorial because i'm going to be showing you how you can train and prompt ai to do the things that you want it to do all right so first of all i've already left the document and the files that contains the prompt and you can see how i'm going to be prompting ai to do certain things so watch this video and make sure you follow exactly to get similar and even better results so here are the prompts we're going to be using of course you find them in the document so we come over here to clean ai where we're going to be converting the images into a video so right here you select the image that is the one you generated using leonardo ai and right here you will come here to copy the prompt number one where the you know the character is currently just talking and you come here to paste it so once you come here to paste it you also come here to copy another prompt this is called the negative prompt this negative prompt is to help remove distortions and some unrealistic look in our videos all right so we're going to come here and scroll down where you're going to see the option to add your negative prompt so once you add it it takes off some unnecessary things from your generation so after that you go ahead to generate it and in a couple of seconds you can see your results so as you can see the gestures are currently okay this is how it's looking you can go ahead to download it and then i'm going to be using kind master to screenshot so i'm going to show you how i'm going to use it basically once you come here to kind master for mobile users you can come here to bring in the video you just do generated using clean ai and just at the last point here because we want it to sync in very well so that there's not going to be any cut in the video you come here to the last part you can do it on your normal video player but here on kai master you can easily capture and save the last part easily so after that you can come here again to clean ai and delete this other one and then bring in the one you screenshotted using kai master that is the last part okay then you can come here to prompt and you go back to the prompts that are shared with you you copy the next prompt here the next prompt shows that the person stands up from the chair okay so you can see the prompt right here you can come here and paste it all right and of course the negative prompt you can leave this particular one or if you want to make changes to it you can come here to copy any of these um negative prompts that i left here so that your you know generation is going to be smooth all right so after that you can go ahead to generate it once you've done generating it trust me your video is going to really be looking very good and awesome and of course just as 
we did previously again you're going to once you have been able to download your video of the person standing up like this you're going to return back to kind master and using the same method i told you the screenshotting method you come here to bring that in and you of course screenshot the last frame okay so that you can use it to generate the next video or the next action just here you come here and click on capture and screenshot so next you're going to be creating your ai voiceovers and to be doing that you can use 11 labs but for the sake of this video i'm going to be using flicky ai so coming here to flicky ai you just have to sign in if you're not yet registered and of course you're going to come here to get started right here you're going to see an option here that says audio and right here you click on the empty option where you're going to type the name of the of the file that you want to create so here i'm going to type avatar pro and of course i'll select the dialect and you also select the language so right here i would select uk english all right so once you're able to do that you can go ahead to submit it and you're going to come here right here very easily you come to scene one scene one and then you can change the voice over or the voice that you want to use you just select any one of your choice or the one that sounds good for you and after you've been able to select it you can come here to paste your script all right so once you've been able to paste the script then you can go ahead to download it very easily so it's very easy to use and you can go ahead to even use other languages korean language chinese language Indi indian language any language of your choice you can go ahead to try it out using flicky ai so if next once you're done with the creation of the voice you come here to cap court and make sure that you bring in all of the videos you created using clean ai of course remember you have been able to create all the scenes before now so you bring them one after after the other to arrange them the first second third and you can see everything is syncing well everything is following very well there is no cut there is everything is just well aligned and that is really interesting so once you're done with that you can go ahead to export it so next we're going to be creating the lip sync for the video and for that you're going to be using the dream face application so for android users you can get that on play store and once you've been able to download it you can come here to open it up right here you can come here to where you have the video lip sync option you just click on it and you're going to be directed to this place where you can come here to first select the avatar all right so if you've not selected the avatar you can go ahead to select it just like this so this is the one i'm going to be using you can confirm and then you come here to import and add scripts audio all right so you're going to come here to select the audio that you currently created using your voice over website either 11 labs or flicky ai then you can go ahead to even change your voice if you want to and then you can go ahead to animate it so in a couple of seconds to manage you are going to have your work ready so now let's check out the final output hey what's up creators welcome back to make money editing in today's video i'm going to show you how to create a fully personalized ultra realistic avatar that can talk make gestures stand work and do anything you prompt it to do